Hello there. I'm Paul Phelps. I'm president of Candlelighters. And I'm Carrie Wong. I'm the executive director of Candlelighters. And we're here tonight to tell you about what we are and what we do and how we're able to do it. And we also want to welcome you to our 10th anniversary of our Have a Heart Valentine's Extravaganza. We welcome all of you. It's wonderful to see old faces and old friends, and it's fantastic to see new people here. And we're so glad that you're here. Right, Paul? This is going to be such a wonderful absolutely night. Absolutely wonderful. And I would add that it's great to see so many young people oh, in the crowd. Oh, isn't it that beautiful thing? makes it a tremendous thing. It's a wonderful thing. Yeah. But what we, what we do is provide emotional and financial support to families whose children have cancer. We cannot medically improve the child's condition, but we can certainly improve the family's condition by the various services that we provide. Very well said. That's it's exactly true. Uh, we have no pediatric oncology services, so all of our families are forced to travel outside of the county for treatment. So we're here to make their lives as easy and as comfortable as we possibly can. So in doing so, this is one of the wonderful things we do every year. It's our, again, our 10th anniversary of our Have a Heart Valentine's Extravaganza. We're going to have a wonderful evening with dancing and good food. We have a live auction, a silent auction. And one of the best parts of our evening, Paul, is the giveaway of our 2012 Hyundai Sonata, graciously donated mm -hmm. by... The, the Nelson, Nelson family, family of Brevard who, Hyundai dealers. There. Was Mr. Nelson started this company yes, 10 did. years ago, and after his death, the family continued the same practice, which has been wonderful for us. So we're looking forward to a wonderful evening, and we hope you enjoy yourselves the same. Uh, what you're about to see um, after we get done speaking is we do have some footage of one of our families. We'd like to take you into their lives just a little bit. Uh, it's little Sarah. Sarah's three years old. She was diagnosed with leukemia this year, or in 2011, and we would like to show you a little bit about their family and the struggles that they go through. And again, thank you all very much. We couldn't do the things that we do without your support and your, gr your gracious contributions, and we are very grateful to all of you, and we hope you have a wonderful evening. And I think if I may add, after you see this clip of the family, you come to realize one of the favorite expressions that I have always used since I've been in Candlelighters. If you have a healthy family, especially healthy children, you are one rich person. Dear Candlelighters, I cannot express how thankful we are for all of you've done. You're all very special to us, and we are glad you're in our corner. You have helped our family so much always there with a kind word or to help with our expenses. If I ever need anything, I know you will always be there. Thank you, Candlelighters, because you do so much for all the families whose children are suffering. I am so happy to know you guys. Thank you for your kindness. We couldn't do this without the candlelighters of Brevard. Thank you just doesn't seem to be enough. Words can't describe the gratitude we feel by you doing what you do. We thank God for putting you and this wonderful organization in our path. We appreciate you and we thank you from the bottom of our hearts.